All right, so we're taking a deep dive into AI and business today. Yeah, a lot of really interesting stuff here. Like, it's one thing when AI is recommending movies or, like, writing poems. Right. But this is, like, next-level stuff. Absolutely, and, and it's a rapidly evolving field. So let's unravel it together. Like, we're detectives in a mystery novel, you know? I like that analogy. With AI as the detective sifting through mountains of data to help businesses make smarter decisions. Yeah, it's fascinating how AI is uncovering patterns that would take humans ages to find. Right. Like, yeah. it's almost like AI is learning to speak the language of machines. That's a good way to put it. Understanding their subtle whispers and groans before they turn into full-blown breakdowns. Especially in industries like manufacturing, where downtime can be super expensive. Oh, absolutely. So let's start with customer service. Okay. Remember those clunky chatbots from a few years back? Oh, yeah. Like pulling teeth. Well, it turns out AI is giving them a major makeover. Yeah, it's like those old chatbots were following a script. But AI-powered chatbots are learning to improvise. Oh, wow. They can handle something like 70% of routine questions now. Really? Yeah, which frees up human agents to deal with the more complex issues. It's like having an army of helpful assistants. Right. But instead of fetching coffee, they're sorting through customer queries with lightning speed. Exactly. And, and they're learning from every interaction, getting smarter and more efficient over time. So it's not just automation. It's like AI is understanding the nuances of human communication. Yeah. It's analyzing your feedback, your tone, even your social media activity. <laughs> on social media, too. To get a complete picture of what the customer really wants. Okay. That sounds a bit like mind reading. Yeah. <laughs> which is both cool and a little creepy. I know, right? But let's be honest. How many times have we wished... Customer service could just anticipate our needs. I know what you mean. Without us having to explain everything. Exactly. It's moving from reactive to proactive. So like a personal concierge for all your customer service needs. Sign me up for that. But AI isn't just changing the game in customer service. It's also shaking things up in marketing. Oh, yeah. Big time. It's almost like there's a bit of mystery surrounding how it's all working. Yeah. Well, traditional marketing is like casting a wide net and hoping to catch a few fish. Right. AI is using sonar to pinpoint exactly where the fish are and tailoring the approach to reel them in. So instead of blasting everyone with the same generic ads, AI is helping companies target their messages. Precisely to the people who are most likely to be interested. Less spam for us, more bang for their buck. Exactly. That's a win-win. It is. So how does AI do that? Well, it can analyze massive amounts of data to create incredibly detailed customer profiles. So like a team of expert detectives building a case file on each potential customer. That's a great analogy. Figuring out their likes, dislikes, and even predicting what they might want to buy next. Yeah. Okay, that does sound a bit like those detective shows where they use algorithms to track down criminals. But instead of catching bad guys, AI is helping businesses connect with the right customers. Exactly. And it's not just about targeted ads. It's about creating truly personalized experiences. Absolutely. Imagine you walk into your favorite store... And instead of generic sales pitches. You're greeted with recommendations tailored to your taste and budget. Exactly. Okay, that's the kind of personalized experience I can get behind. I think we all can. No more wading through racks of clothes that I would never wear in a million years. It's like having a personal stylist who knows you better than you know yourself. Pretty cool. And this level of personalization extends beyond brick and mortar stores, right? Oh, yeah. AI is powering those recommendation engines on e-commerce sites. Right. Suggesting products based on your browsing history, past purchases. So it's like having a virtual shopping buddy who knows my style mm -hmm. and can point me towards the hidden gems I might have otherwise missed. Exactly. I like that virtual shopping buddy. I think we all do. But where else is AI working its magic in the business world? Well, let's shift gears and talk about global supply chains. Okay. You know how frustrating it can be to order something online and then wait weeks for it to arrive? Oh, tell me about it. <laughs> I once ordered a pair of shoes online, and they took so long to arrive that I practically forgot I had ordered them. Yeah, AI is working on that. Really? Yeah. Wow. It's optimizing delivery routes, predicting potential disruptions, and coordinating with suppliers. So it's like the ultimate traffic cop directing the flow of goods around the world. It's more like a conductor orchestrating a complex symphony of moving parts. Making sure everything arrives on time and in perfect condition. Right. Okay, that's a pretty impressive feat. It is. But wait, there's more, right? I heard AI can even predict when a machine needs maintenance. You heard right. How is that even possible? Well, think of it like this. Every machine has a heartbeat. 
a unique rhythm that changes over time. Okay. AI is learning to listen to those heartbeats, detecting subtle variations that might indicate a problem. Before it becomes a major breakdown. So AI is like a doctor for machines diagnosing issues before they become serious. That's a good way to put it. That's amazing. It is. It's shifting from reactive maintenance to predictive maintenance. It is. That's a huge win for businesses, and it probably means fewer product delays for consumers like me. Absolutely. But what about the human element? Oh, that's a big one. How is AI impacting the way companies manage their employees? That's an excellent question, and it's one that raises a lot of interesting considerations. I bet. We'll delve into those aspects in just a bit. Okay, sounds good. Yeah. So we were talking about how AI is influencing the way companies manage their employees. Yeah, it's a bit of a tightrope walk, isn't it? It is. Finding that balance between streamlining processes and making sure employees still feel valued. Absolutely. One area where AI is making a big impact is in recruitment. Oh, yeah. How so? Well, think about it. Sifting through resumes can be super time consuming. Especially for big companies. Especially for large companies that get thousands of applications. It's like trying to find a needle in a haystack. That's a great analogy. AI can help automate that initial screening process. Really? Yeah, analyzing resumes and cover letters to identify the best candidates. So it's like a super efficient recruiter scanning resumes at lightning speed. It's more like a matchmaker connecting companies with the right talent. That makes sense. It frees up human recruiters to do what they do best. Exactly. Connecting with people, assessing their fit for the company culture. Right. And I've also heard that AI can help with employee retention. Oh, really? How does that work? Imagine you're a manager with a team of talented employees. You want to keep them happy and engaged. Right. But it can be tough to know what's going on in their minds. Like trying to solve a puzzle where you don't have all the pieces. Exactly. AI can help fill in those missing pieces. Oh. By analyzing employee data, like performance reviews, email communication, even social media activity. Hold on, social media. Are companies using AI to monitor what their employees are posting online? It's not about spying on employees. It's about looking for patterns that might indicate dissatisfaction. So, like, if someone's constantly posting negative comments about their job. That could be a red flag. No, that's like an early warning system. It is. That can alert managers to potential problems before they escalate. Precisely. AI can help companies identify employees who might be at risk of leaving. And proactively address any concerns they may have. Exactly. Okay, that makes sense. It's all about using data to understand employee sentiment. Right. And create a workplace where people feel valued. Exactly. But let's shift gears again and talk about money. Okay, everyone's favorite topic. How is AI transforming the world of finance? I'm all ears. Tell me about the financial wizardry AI is capable of. Well, one of the most impactful applications is in fraud detection. Oh, yeah. Those alerts that pop up on my phone whenever I buy something slightly out of the ordinary. Well, AI is the secret weapon behind those alerts. Really? It's constantly analyzing millions of transactions, looking for patterns that might indicate fraud. So like a digital detective watching over my account. That's a good way to put it. Making sure no one's trying to steal my money. It can detect subtle anomalies that would be almost impossible for a human to spot. That's impressive. But what about those of us who are, shall we say, less than savvy when it comes to managing our own money? AI can help there, too. Really? AI-powered financial management apps are becoming increasingly popular. Like having a personal financial advisor in my pocket. Exactly. Okay, I'm intrigued. What can these AI advisors do? Well, they can help you track your spending, create a budget, and even suggest ways to save money. So it's like having a financial guru who knows my spending habits better than I do. And as these AI advisors learn more about you, right. they can give even more personalized advice. That sounds pretty cool, especially uh -huh. for someone like me who tends to avoid budgeting like the plague. Right. But what about the bigger picture? How is AI impacting the world of investments? This is where things get really fascinating. Imagine an AI system that can analyze market trends, company performance data, even news sentiment to predict which stocks are likely to go up or down. Hold on, predicting the stock market? Wow. Isn't that kind of like trying to predict the weather? It's not about predicting the future with 100% certainty, Okay. but it's using data to make more informed decisions. So it's like having a team of super smart analysts working around the clock. 
That's a great way to put it. Crunching numbers and looking for opportunities. Exactly. AI can help investors identify potential investments, manage risk, and optimize their portfolios in ways that were never before possible. Okay, this is starting to sound like something out of a science fiction movie. AI is like the ultimate financial mastermind, outsmarting the market and making everyone rich. It's not quite that simple, of course. Right. AI is a tool, and like any tool, it can be used for good or bad. Good point. It's important to remember that AI-powered investment strategies still come with risks. Yeah. And it's crucial to work with experienced financial professionals. To make sure your investments are right for you. Exactly. But it's clear that AI is transforming the financial landscape in profound ways. From how we manage our personal finances to how global markets operate. Absolutely. And this transformation is just beginning. It's incredible to think about all the possibilities. Right. But let's shift gears one more time okay. and talk about healthcare. All right. How is AI changing the way we diagnose and treat diseases? This is where AI has the potential to truly revolutionize lives. Tell me more. Imagine a world where diseases are detected, earlier treatments are more personalized, and drug discovery happens at warp speed. Okay, now that's the kind of future I can get behind. One of the most exciting applications is in medical imaging analysis. Oh yeah, how so? You know how doctors use x-rays, CT scans, and MRIs to look inside the body? Yeah, but those images can be pretty hard to decipher, mm. even for trained professionals. Well, AI is giving doctors a super-powered set of eyes. Really? AI systems can analyze medical images with incredible precision detecting subtle abnormalities that might be missed by the human eye. So it's like having a second opinion from the world's best radiologist, but instantly and without any human bias. That's a great way to put it. This can be a game changer when it comes to early detection of diseases like cancer, heart disease, and stroke. That's incredible, but how accurate are these AI systems? That's a valid question. Can we really trust them to make life or death decisions? AI systems are rigorously tested and validated before they're used in clinical practice. So it's not just about blindly trusting the AI. It's not. But making sure it's been thoroughly vetted and proven to be reliable. Exactly. And even then, AI is often used as a tool to assist doctors, not replace them. Okay, that makes sense. It's a collaboration, just okay. like in finance and other fields. It is. But what about the drug discovery process? Oh, that's a big one. How is AI speeding things up in that area? Traditionally, drug discovery has been a slow and expensive process, Yeah. often taking years and billions of dollars to bring a new drug to market. I've heard stories about scientists testing thousands of compounds, hoping to find that one magic bullet right. that will cure a disease. It sounds like a needle in a haystack situation. That's a good analogy, but AI is changing the game. How so? By using its analytical prowess to identify promising drug candidates much faster. So it's analyzing all those chemical compounds yes. and figuring out which ones might be effective. AI can sift through vast databases of molecular structures, Wow! analyze their properties, and even simulate how they might interact with the human body. So AI is like a super-powered chemist? It's more like a research assistant. Providing insights and guidance. To help human scientists make faster progress. This is all so fascinating. It's, uh, it's amazing to think about how AI is transforming so many aspects of healthcare, from diagnostics to treatment to drug discovery. It is pretty amazing. But where else is AI making ways in the business world? Well, let's take a look at manufacturing. Oh, okay. You know how we were talking about those robots with super senses on the factory floor? Yeah, those AI-powered inspectors that can spot a flaw smaller than a speck of dust. Well, that's just the tip of the iceberg. AI is transforming manufacturing in ways we never thought possible. Okay, I'm all ears. What else is AI up to in the world of factories and assembly lines? Okay, I'm all ears. What else is AI up to in the world of factories and assembly lines? Imagine a factory where the lights never go out. The machines are humming in perfect harmony and every single product rolls off the line flawless. That's the vision AI is helping manufacturers bring to life. It sounds like something out of a futuristic movie, mm. but how does AI make that level of precision and efficiency possible? One of the key ways is through something called predictive maintenance. Remember how we talked about AI being able to diagnose problems in machines before they even happen? Yeah, like having a sixth sense for when a machine is about to throw a tantrum. Exactly. By analyzing data from sensors embedded in machines, AI can detect those subtle changes that might indicate an impending failure. And this allows manufacturers to schedule maintenance proactively, minimizing downtime and avoiding those costly repairs. So it's like having a crystal ball that tells you when a machine is about to go kaput. 
That's a good way to put it. No more scrambling to fix things at the last minute, which means less disruption and more productivity. Precisely. But AI's impact on manufacturing goes beyond just keeping the machines running smoothly. It's also transforming the way products are designed and made. Okay, now that sounds intriguing. How is AI changing the design and manufacturing process? Imagine this, you're an engineer designing a new car. Traditionally, you'd start with sketches, build prototypes, test them rigorously, refining the design over multiple iterations. This process can be time consuming and expensive. Yeah, I can imagine all the trial and error involved. It's like trying to solve a complex puzzle where the pieces keep changing. That's a great analogy. AI is like having a puzzle master on your team, helping you find the right pieces and fit them together more efficiently. AI-powered design tools can simulate different designs, analyze their performance under various conditions, and even suggest optimizations based on data from previous designs. So it's like having a virtual assistant that can help you design and test products in a virtual world before you even build a physical prototype. That could save a ton of time and money. Absolutely. And it allows engineers to explore a wider range of design possibilities, leading to more innovative and optimized products. But AI's impact on manufacturing goes even further. It's also helping companies make their factories smarter and more adaptable. Smarter and more adaptable. How does AI do that? Think of traditional factories like giant machines churning out the same product day after day. With AI, factories can become more like living organisms able to sense and respond to changes in their environment. Okay, now you're really making my brain stretch. <laughs> factories as living organisms. Tell me more about this. Imagine a factory that can automatically adjust production lines based on real-time demand, switching from making one product to another seamlessly. Or a factory that can optimize its energy consumption based on weather patterns and electricity prices. So AI is giving factories a brain and a nervous system, allowing them to adapt to changing conditions and make decisions on the fly. Exactly. This kind of flexibility and responsiveness is crucial in today's fast-paced market, where consumer preferences can change overnight. This is all incredible. It sounds like AI is turning manufacturing into a high-tech ballet with robots and machines moving in perfect sync, adapting to changes and creating products with incredible precision. It's a beautiful and complex dance, and AI is the choreographer making sure every move is optimized for efficiency, quality, and innovation. This has been an incredible journey through the world of AI in business. We've covered so much ground from customer service to finance to manufacturing, and it's clear that AI is transforming every industry imaginable. What are some of the key takeaways for our listeners? The biggest takeaway is that AI is not some distant future technology. It's here, it's now, and it's already having a profound impact on our lives, whether we realize it or not. It's like AI is working behind the scenes, making things run smoother, faster, and smarter. From the websites we browse to the products we buy to the healthcare we receive. Exactly. And as AI continues to evolve, we can expect to see even more innovative applications emerge, changing the way we live, work, and interact with the world around us. That's both exciting and a little daunting. What should our listeners be thinking about as they navigate this rapidly evolving landscape? I think as AI becomes more integrated into our lives, it's important to stay informed and engaged. Ask questions, explore the possibilities, and consider the ethical implications. The future of AI is being shaped right now, and we all have a role to play in ensuring it's a future that benefits everyone. Well said. Thank you for taking us on this deep dive into the world of AI and business. It's been a mind-blowing journey. It's been a pleasure sharing these insights with you. And to our listeners, keep exploring, keep learning, and stay curious. The world of AI is full of surprises, and who knows what amazing discoveries await us just around the corner. Thanks for tuning in, everyone. We'll catch you next time for another deep dive into the fascinating world of technology and innovation.